you know, BPH most commonly affects the geriatric patients, usually above the age of 50 years or 60 years. So most of these patients are usually associated with the comorbidities conditions like diabetes, hypertension, asthma and the coronary artery disease. So the optimization of these comorbidities are very very important in the treatment of the BPH. And some of the patients is having high blood sugar, it may lead to polyuria, nocturia which may uh, confuse the diagnosis of BPH. So the optimization of all these comorbid conditions, strict control of the diabetes, strict control of the hypertension, taking care of the coronary artery diseases helps in uh, treatment of the BPH and the support the uh, patient needs any surgical intervention for the BPH. The adequate blood sugar control is very very important during the preoperative period, intraoperative period and during the recovery phases. The patient compliance in the management of BPH is very very important. Some patients do uh, come with the mild obstructive lower irritant symptoms with the BPH. Such patients we advise, we usually put them on uh, medication, combination of medication like tamsulosine and dutasterol, silodosine and dutasterol combination. So when the patient needs to take these tablets daily, on daily basis and regularly, we have seen some patients, they got two tablets, one tamsulosine, they take, keep taking it alternate and sometimes when they come for a follow up, they take it for one week or two weeks when they get rid of the symptoms they completely stop the medi medication so the compliance of the patient the treatment of bph and the regular intake of the medication is very very important the lifestyle modification management bph as you know bph is an uh, BPH most commonly affects the elderly population. The changes or modification, uh, modification in the lifestyle, uh, uh, ch lifestyle situation really helps. Uh, like uh, avoiding caffeine intake, cessation of the smoking, avoiding alcohol intake, reduction in the weight base, strict control of the diabetes, control of asthma, regular daily exercises, and avoidance of certain high fatty foods and other factors also helps in the management of the. BPH mainly the strict control of the diabetes uh, by lifestyle medication lifestyle modification definitely need this is also one of the important contributing factor in the management of the BPH thank you